Lord Schnitzel, the stand side, and Captain CJ, and off you go, is joining in over the final fence, and not my, and off you go, is gone, is carefully selected, made to work here on Debo, but will win, stays on to win the Jim Ryan Racecourse Services, beginners, second is Lord Schnitzel, Captain beginners, and CJ is third, and then Star Max and Mormon with the break to on the ropes. Lord Schnitzel, the stand side, then Captain CJ, and off you go, is joining in over the final fence. And not my, and off you go, is gone. Is carefully selected, made to work here on Debo, but will win. Stays on to win the Jim Ryan race course. Services beginners. Second is Lord Schnitzel, Captain CJ is third. And then Star Max and Mormon with the break to on the ropes. And it's Dimi Plie in front. Simon Torrance is not yet up. Dimi Plie from Moscow not yet up. White and Mrs. Lovett as they come down to the final fence. And over the last, it's Dimi Plie by two lengths to Moscow. White and Mrs. Lovett, they're well clear from the Caddy Rose inside the final 100 yards. And Anya O'Connor had just an insurance look across at the big screen, has won well on Dimi Plie. Second by Fourth, the Caddy Rose, and the only other finisher is Oh Me Oh My. And it's Dimmy Plie in front. Simon Torrens is not yet up. Dimmy Plie from Moscovite and Mrs. Lovett as they come down to the final fence. And over the last, it's Dimmy Plie by two lengths to Moscovite and Mrs. Lovett. They're well clings to Moscow from the Caddy Rose inside the final hundred yards. And Anya O'Connor had just an insurance look across at the big screen, has won well on Dimmy Plie. Second, Moscovite. Third, Mrs. Lovett. Fourth, the Caddy Rose. And the only other finisher is Oh Me Oh My. To the final fence, and it is Avenue Dunvi and Jack Kennedy at the last, and over Kildurri, a horrible fall, and left second is Duca de Tay, and then Dr. Phoenix. Jack Kennedy is in luck. On his fourth ride back as Avenir Dunvi wins easy down the easy fix handicap from Dr. Phoenix and Duca de Tay. It's a And conflated is delivered by Jack Kennedy, has come not ahead. Bentham January just conflated is veering left and right as they race into the closing stages. Conflated has their measure as they run up to the finish and will win takingly. And it's double alert for Jack Kennedy, Gordon Elliott, as conflated won well from January Jet Sempo. Bentham, you raise me up, Cedarwood Road, and Sumchu next. The one we lost at some point was. 25 reverse polarity and conflated is delivered by Jack Kennedy has come not ahead Bentham January just conflated is veering left and right as they race into the closing stages conflated has their measure as they run up to the finish and will win takingly and it's double alert for Jack Kennedy Gordon Elliott as conflated won well from January Jet Sempo Bentham you raise me up Cedarwood Road and Sumchu next the one we lost at some point was 25 reverse polarity. But it's Party Playboy and Mikey Fogarty coming away at the final flight. Party Playboy over and clear. Six, seven lengths up on definite plan second and then gold speed. But it is Party Playboy who ran the race of his life to finish second in the English Cesare, which has rumped home from definite plan. Our friend Gold Speed, Black Hills of Dakota but it's Party Playboy and Mikey Fogarty coming away at the final flight. Party Playboy over and clear. Six, seven lengths up on definite plan second and then gold speed. But it is Party Playboy who ran the race of his life to finish second in the English Cesare, which has rumped home from definite plan. Our friend Gold Speed, Black Hills of Dakota.
Drummer Coe's not out of it. And then Avellino, Jukebox Jive has quickly dropped back at the final flight. Bad mistake by Drummer Coe, and it's Brawler. And Anya O'Connor, who picked up a chance ride, will uh, score on two of today's winners as Brawler is driven out to beat Drummer Coe, whose jockey, Trevor Ryan, has finished without the aid of his irons. And third was Pivotal Flame. Drummer Coe's not out of it, and then Avellino Jukebox Jive has quickly dropped back at the final flight. Bad mistake by Drummer Coe, and it's Brawler. And Anya O'Connor, who picked up a chance ride, will uh, score on two of today's winners as Brawler is driven out to beat Drummer Coe, whose jockey, Trevor Ryan, has finished without the aid of his irons, and third was Pivotal Flame. In between horses is appreciated and then Axiomatic Port Stanley and Barnavadon are following an after-go. Esky Lane on the near side comes to pick it up from Assemble in third place is appreciated. These three have pulled clear of the remainder. Esky Lane is just beginning to gain the upper hand. Assemble is rallying on the inside. They're going towards the line. Esky Lane, Assemble, Assemble and Esky Lane. In third is appreciated and they're clear from Barnabas on, and we'll park it there until half 12 tomorrow. In between horses is appreciated, and then Axiomatic Port Stanley and Barnavadon are following an after go. Esky Lane on the near side comes to pick it up from Assemble in third place is appreciated. These three have pulled clear of the remainder. Esky Lane is just beginning to gain the upper hand. Assemble is rallying on the inside. They're going towards the line. Esky Lane, Assemble, Assemble, and Esky Lane. In third is appreciated, and they're clear from Barnavadon, and we'll park it there until half twelve tomorrow.